Oh, gosh, I'm soaked. <laughs> I should probably change this book. Oh, hi. You scared me. I did not think somebody would be in my cabin. Who are you? Oh. Uh, yeah. yeah, I get it. Your friends with Scott, right? Mm -hmm. He said one of his friends will be joining us, but he wasn't sure. So you're the friend, huh? Well, you're here pretty late. How come you decided to come now? You changed your mind. Hmm. Fair enough. Just wanted a little bit of sun in your life. <laughs> yeah, I get that. Well, how come you're in my cabin? Oh. Oh, we're sharing. Uh, no, I have no problem with it. I just wasn't expecting to share with somebody. I mean, I I just didn't know you were coming, that's all. If I did, I would have probably been more prepared. Well, I got a lot of clothes that I... Should, shouldn't wear with someone around me, I guess. But you'll be fine. We're both adults, right? Yeah. Uh, so which bed do you want? Because I... Actually, no. You can't choose. I already want the right bed. <laughs> it's closer to the door, you know? That way, if somebody comes in here, they'll probably come for me first. <laughs> I don't know why I just said that. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, it's nice to meet you. I'm Aaron. Mm -hmm. You don't look familiar. I thought maybe I'd know you, because I'm usually familiar with most people. You went to school with us? Uh, we were in the same grade. Really? It's kind of weird. I think I would have remembered you if you were. I knew almost everyone in school. Not to sound conceited or anything, but I was kind of popular. Which is kind of cringy now that I say it, but <laughs> it's the truth. I was on the cheerleading team, so I made a lot of friends on there, and I also dated the quarterback. Yeah, I think that was one of the reasons why I became good friends with a lot of people. And why it's kind of weird that I haven't seen you before. Oh, old pictures. Yeah, go ahead. Maybe if I see old pictures, I'll remember Let's see. What? That's you? <laughs> yeah, I, I remember you. Yeah, I remember seeing you in the hallways, but we never had a class together, so I wouldn't have been able to talk to you anyways, but you have changed a lot. You've had a major glow up. <laughs> yeah, like a major glow up. You got a little bit taller too, didn't you? used to be shorter. Wow. Yeah, you just... <laughs> you look... Uh, you look good, obviously. Just very different, which is why I didn't recognize you at all. Well, um... Seeing as this is our first time officially meeting, it is very good to meet you. And also share a cabin with you, apparently. I mean, it's only a couple days. It will be a fun vacation. I'm sure we'll have a good time together. Besides, everyone here is in their own couples, and you and I are the single ones, so we can be single together. Plus, I think single people have the most fun, don't you agree? <laughs> You're surprised that I'm single? Why is that shocking? Mmm... <laughs> Thank you. Uh, was that your way of trying to compliment me? No, I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it. Honestly, I, I just recently got out of a relationship, so I'm not really looking for anything. The same guy we went to school with? <laughs> yeah, we stayed together for a while. And we just recently decided to call it quits. I'm not gonna lie, this vacation is part of the reason why. 
well, he made a big deal about me going out with my friends, especially because there's a bunch of boys and whatever, even though it's not just boys, but he was insecure and he tried to control me a lot, so I thought it was toxic and I left. And now I'm here having a blast. <laughs> I just finished having a swim. The water is amazing, by the way. We should go take a swim together. Mm, what, are you a bad swimmer? Are you afraid that I will outswim you? <laughs> well, I'm a pretty good swimmer, I'm not gonna lie. Mm, I've been told. And I also took a lot of swimming lessons back in the day. But then again, I was big on activities, so I took a lot of lessons for many things. Mm -hmm. I tried joining the volleyball team, and I wasn't really a fan of the people in it, so I didn't stay much, but <laughs> the sport itself is really fun. Yeah, of course I'm a sports girl. Do I not look it? <laughs> oh, I can be a girly girl too. I'm both. I guess you can say I multitask. I'm glad to see that you're so interested in my life. <laughs> no, it's refreshing. I haven't really seen someone being so interested in me before. Off the get-go, too. I mean, we just met. But I'm not gonna lie, I like your energy a lot. It's very calming, and I feel like you and I can be really good friends. No, really. Why? Do you think I would want to be friends with you or something? <laughs> no, that's not the case at all. I love making new friends, especially when they're cute like you. <laughs> that's kind of cute. Are you blushing? Mm, I don't know. I think I see a little something. You're trying to hide it. <laughs> Sorry. I can come off a little forward sometimes, I don't want to scare you off or anything, but... Just trying to have my little fun with flirting. Well, anyways, I don't want to take too much of your time. I can go back out and swim, and you can unpack your stuff. No? Well, what's that? You like talking to me? <laughs> Are you enjoying this conversation that we're having? I am too. I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty glad that you decided to come out after all. Well, Scott has said amazing things about you. I mean, <laughs> every time we go out, he always mentions you. He's talking about how you need to join us, and he thinks you'd have fun with us every time we do something new. It's kind of cute. I hadn't seen him talk about someone like that in a while ever actually so it shows that he cares about you and also scott has you know some good judgment <laughs> so if his opinion on you is good then obviously you must be doing something right and now i'm curious because i want to know what's so amazing about you <laughs> well you can continue unpacking it's fine yeah i'll just watch you I would sit down, but I'm wet from swimming, so I was planning on coming to take a shower so I can go out. We're planning to do a bonfire, some s'mores by the beach. Yeah? You know, I happen to be pretty good at s'mores. I'll make you a very good s'more. You're always going to want to come here with me. <laughs> I'm going to make sure that every time you eat a s'more, you remember the girl that you went on vacation with who made a really, really good s'mores. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have you call me and be like, hey, make me some more of those s'mores that you made me before. <laughs> Sorry, am I coming off so arrogant? Mm. No, I guess I'm just pretty confident in my s'mores skills. <sighs> So now that we're here, why don't you tell me a little more about you? You know, before we end up sharing a cabin together 
I don't want to end up dead today. You could be a psycho. <laughs> You're not. I don't get the vibe. I'm just teasing you. But yeah. What is there to know about you? How did you meet Scott? From school, I'm guessing. Yeah? Oh, you guys were good friends. That's good. Me? I actually wasn't really friends with him in high school. No, we became friends after. We worked at the same cafe. <laughs> yeah. We were co-workers, and then we became good friends, and... Just kind of formed our own little friendship group, and now you're part of it. I don't mind that. Well, I think we could use a new friend in our group. And also, you seem like you have a really good vibe and energy, and I like that. I don't know why I just get that from you. But I don't want to give you a big head, so I'm just going to stop talking. <laughs> so, do you have a girlfriend? Well, I'm only asking because then I, I was going to wonder why you didn't bring her with you. So you don't have a girlfriend. I imagine that you won't have a hard time finding one here. <laughs> what? You seem surprised by that. You're pretty good looking, you know. Do you not think you are? You're actually really good looking. Well, I think it might be your eyes. I like them. <laughs> They're different than mine. Which is nice, you know, I think uh, opposites attract, right? <laughs> what? <laughs> no, it's just kind of cute because you get flustered by things I say. Why is that? And how is it that you knew about me in high school, but I didn't know you? Oh, really? That makes sense. <laughs> Damn, I kind of wish I was friends with you. I think you would have been really fun. You would have. I mean, <laughs> you come off as a little shy, but I think you have a little spicy side in you. Do you agree? I see it. I'm pretty good at spotting it. But, you know, here's the wild thing. I'm into the shy ones. <laughs> well, like I said, opposites attract. I am the opposite of shy. In fact, I'm very outgoing and a little bit flirty, but only when it comes to the right people. It's not like I go around flirting with everyone, obviously. The ones that deserve it. And I think it's nice when there's someone a little bit more grounded that I'm into, if that makes sense. Can't have two outgoing people, can we? Exactly. <laughs> See? We're on the same wavelength, too. This is going amazing. So, I'm pretty curious. I want to see your swim clothes. <laughs> Well, that's going to determine if I'm going to get the ick or not. I'm just curious, that's all. I mean, you are planning to do a lot of swimming, aren't you? Well, what more are you going to do? We're all here so we can have a little beach trip. Some s'mores by the fire. Some drinks. <laughs> Ooh, you know, it would be so fun if we take a light swim. Like when it's dark, so we can look at the stars. Ugh, oh, that sounds a little bit corny, doesn't it? <laughs> I think it would be cute. A little stargazing moment. Maybe a skinny dipping. Ugh, oh, I have all these ideas planned now. Would you want to try it with me? I mean, I think we should make this an unforgettable vacation, and... We should make the most of it before it's too late. 
You and I can just do our own thing. Everyone else can do whatever they're doing. They're already in their own couples and being all lovey-dovey. They don't have to rub it in our face. I'm just so glad that I'm not the only single one anymore. Not the ah cheap out. Yeah. Truth be told, I was hoping that you would join us. Although I wasn't sure if we'd end up sharing a cabin or not. I don't mind it. Do you snore? Like, loudly. Okay, good. As long as you don't snore or, like, sleep talk or something, I think we're good. I pick up on those things. Mm. No, I don't snore. I think you'll find out pretty soon. <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? You like my swimsuit? Oh, thanks. I chose a couple cute swimsuits. I've been waiting for this vacation for so long. <laughs> I need it. So I came prepared. I went and did a little bikini shopping. Mm -hmm. You'll see a lot more bikinis, don't worry. <laughs> but you don't have to keep staring at me like that. Like I'm a piece of candy or something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, are you gonna unpack? Like, do you not want to go for some yet? We can always finish unpacking later. The night is young, and you don't want to catch the sunset? It'll be really cool. <laughs> yeah, if we can, like, watch it together. You're down? I'm down too. Um. Yeah. Now I'm the awkward one. I don't know. Just the way you're looking at me is making me a little nervous, I guess. <laughs> mm hmm. Maybe you're not as shy as I thought you were. Well, those looks that you're giving me are. They say otherwise. Mm-hmm. Well. We should probably go out and join everyone else. Do they even know that you're here? Scott knows. Okay, so the others probably know too. He just... <laughs> he forgot to mention that I would be sharing the cabin with you. Do you think he planned it? <laughs> I can see him doing that. Ever since my breakup, he's been trying to set me up with someone, and it obviously hasn't worked out. I mean, yeah, I've had the opportunity to get back in a relationship with somebody, but I just didn't want it. Unless I found that person that I think is worth my time, I'm not gonna sit there and search for somebody. You know, I think it's important to appreciate your own company sometimes. But if the right person comes along, then I wouldn't mind sharing it with them. Letting them into my zone, if you know what I mean. <laughs> hmm? You think it would be easy for me? Well, yeah. I mean, I, I got a few looks out there already. <laughs> but I don't know I think I'm just at a point in my life where I want something a little more serious I'm over the whole vacation lover thing <laughs> I wasn't really planning on coming here and hooking up with somebody or something no, I generally just wanted to come have a good time by the beach tan a little bit since I'm getting a little too pale you don't think so? Oh, you like my complexion? <laughs> Thank you. I think the sun hit me a little bit today, though. I look a little sunburnt. I've honestly been in the water all day. I think I was the first one here. <laughs> well, I love the beach, and I love swimming, so two of my favorite things. Are you good with sandcastles? 
<laughs> I sound five. <laughs> we can do like sandcastles together. Or you can make me a little mermaid tail. Ugh, leave me alone. I'm just trying to relive my childhood. What's so wrong about that? Anyways, let me help you unpack so we can make this faster and go out for a little swim before it gets dark. So we can catch the sunset. <laughs> What's this? <laughs> Are these sharks on your shorts? That is adorable. <laughs> no, it really is. It's so cute. Oh, you have to put those on. Like right now. I need to see them on you. Oh, please. Come on. Please. I'll look away. Just, you can try them on for five seconds and then take them off. Please. It would make my day. You would. No, there's nothing wrong with them. They're cute. Just a little different, I guess. But, okay, here, I'll, I'll turn around so you can try them on. I'm not looking, I promise. <laughs> That's fine, you need to be prepared for the swim anyways, so might as well wear your swim shorts. Sh should I turn now? Okay, cool. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Those are so freaking cute. They fit you so well. Blue is your color. No, it really is. I love that. Well, just the fact that you're not... You don't care. You know, I think that's really cute. And also, the design is sick, in my opinion. I can wear a blue bikini, so then we can just match together. But it won't have sharks on it. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, don't take it off. I think it looks really cute on you. They won't make fun of you. I mean, you got it for a reason, so obviously you don't care. It's not even that bad. I just like to poke a little fun. What? You don't want me to help you unpack anymore? You think I'm just going to make fun of the rest of your clothes? No, I'm not. I'm not, I promise. Here, come on. I won't even unfold everything, I promise. I'll just take them out so that you can, you know, hang them up, and then we can go for a little swim. <laughs> you know, I'm really craving a popsicle. We can go get some ice cream. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of surprised by how comfortable I am with you already. I know I'm kind of outgoing and, you know, it's easier for me to make friends sometimes, but with you, it's different. It's almost like we've known each other before, even though we haven't. I don't know, it's really cool. <laughs> Refreshing almost, yeah. Just easy talking to you and joking around, and I really like how you don't take offense to a lot of things I say. I can be a little... A little bit of a jokester sometimes. Maybe a big one, but it's just in my nature, and I like the fact that you kind of reciprocate it. Our energy is so similar. It really is kind of crazy. Well, maybe we were meant to come on this vacation together so we can become friends. <laughs> or more. Huh? I didn't say anything. No, I didn't say anything. You're hearing stuff. Alright, we're almost done. You didn't pack a lot of things, which is good. You don't want to see my suitcase. Oh, I have a lot of stuff in there. I told you I wanted to come prepared. Mm-hmm. And I got a little snacks as well, because, you know, there's nothing wrong with uh, some drinks. <laughs> One thing about me, I like to be the life of the party, so if I have to get the drinks, then I'll get the drinks. We can have our own little drinking night. We can stay up all night today, just, you know, trying to get to know each other better and drinking and stuff. Sounds like a blast. <laughs> like a little sleepover. Mm -hmm. 
You're interesting. I'd like to get to know you a little better. Me? I am an open book. There's not much to know about me. And obviously, if there is, I'll tell you. What's that? Do I have a type? Oh, you're interested about my type now, huh? <laughs> Why are you asking me that? Oh, I think it's cute. <laughs> I told you I'm an open book, so obviously I'll answer that. Honestly, I don't really have a type. I just like somebody with a good personality and a good sense of humor. Someone who understands me. And just someone who takes care of themselves, I guess. Obviously, back in the day, I was a little picky. I mean, I was a teenage girl. I think we all have our own preferences when we're younger. But now that I'm older, I just want someone with a good personality. And if you can make me laugh, brownie points for you. But what about you? What is your type? Mm-hmm. That sounds a lot like me. <laughs> it does. Most of those qualities are pretty... I mean, I fit them. Not to sound arrogant or anything, but it's true. So if that's your type, do you think I'm, you know, your type? You're not saying anything. I'm gonna take that as a yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's cute. <laughs> I'm glad that I'm your type. What? You just keep staring at me weirdly. I can't explain it. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, okay? Let's just finish unpacking your stuff. <laughs> so... Were you hoping to come here and find somebody? Or just here for a little bit of fun? Mm-hmm. That's cute. I like that answer. You seem like someone who likes to have a good time. Just like me. We'll have a great time together. I wasn't sure if I should mention it earlier, but now that you're shirtless, I guess, um, I, I just want to say that you look really good, and obviously you've been, uh, taking care of yourself, right? Yeah, I can see that. <laughs> you have a nice body. <clears throat> Anyways, um, I think we're almost done here. We can always come back to it later. Are you ready? Do you have your sunblock on? No? What are you waiting for then? Get over here. Well, we can't have you getting all sunburnt and possibly sick in the future, so I'm just going to smear this all over you. <laughs> Stay still. You're lucky I got extra. Did you even pack any with you? Of course you didn't. Gosh, I found your first red flag. Not very prepared. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You'll be fine. Plus the sun's setting soon, so... I'm sure you'll be okay. There you go. You have some smooth skin. <laughs> All good. Alright, so I think we're good to go. Mm hmm? What? That's fine with me. Yeah, I think we're gonna have a good time together. And, you know, if we have nothing to do later, we can go back out for a swim again. Just a late night swim, I guess. Only if you're cool with it. You're not scared of jellyfish or something, are you? <laughs> mm, we'll be fine. We're adults, we can handle ourselves. Alright, let's
let's go.